not all boundaries between tectonic plates are divergent where they spread apart from each other. Otherwise, the Earth would be expanding. Obviously, then some are convergent where they collide. What happens? Well, in cases where oceanic plates meet continental plates, the oceanic plates are more dense and the continental plates are less dense. And so therefore the oceanic plates will subduct underneath the continental plates. As the oceanic crust subducts, it heats and this causes different materials within the crust to separate. The denser material sinks deeper into the mantle. It can ultimately be recycled, being uh, produced as new crust at a mid-ocean ridge. And thus there can be a rock cycle where rock becomes part of oceanic crust, then uh, after subduction becomes uh, magma in the mantle once again, and then later becomes more oceanic crust. The less dense materials from partially molten uh, oceanic crust can rise to the surface as magma. As the partially molten uh, components of the ocean crust rise, uh, this igneous material can fill vertical faults and form dikes. It can form uh, sills if it fills in a horizontal fissure. It can be released from uh, the mountain in a volcanic eruption, and there can be a whole chain of these uh, mountains along the uh, line of the subduction uh, forming a volcanic arc. Or a mass amount of magma can simply form a pluton or a batholith. Once these solidify, say producing granite, this could then form a mass of granite uh, which has intruded into another geological strata. One of the signs that an area lies over a subduction zone, an area where an oceanic plate once met a continental plate, is the presence of ophiolites. These ophiolites they contain multiple layers, uh, some which are representative of oceanic crust, some which are representative of the sediments over the oceanic crust, and then others underneath the oceanic crust which represent uh, material from the mantle. Uh, there is no reason for this type of sequence to exist on land other than as the subducted oceanic plate was being broken up and partially melted uh, that these fragments uh, then found their way to the surface.